With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, in this question given for the reaction 1 by 8 acid solid plus 3 by 2 O2 gas gives the SO3 gas gives the SO3 gas the difference of heat change at a constant pressure and constant volume at a 27 degree Celsius BV. So in this question we have to given the one chemical reaction we have to calculate the difference between heat exchange at a constant pressure and a constant volume at the temperature 27 degree Celsius. So in this question we have to given the temperature T temperature T we have to given temperature T that is equals to 27 degree Celsius temperature T is the given 27 in degree Celsius. So now we can convert this degree Celsius into a Kelvin. We add a 273 in a as it is in a degree Celsius that is equals to 300 Kelvin. So now we can write the temperature in terms of a Kelvin that is in, in terms of degree Celsius that is a 27 degree Celsius but in terms of a Kelvin temperature that is equals to 300 in Kelvin. So now we have to given the chemical reaction the chemical reaction we have to given 1 by 8 S8 solid S8 solid plus 3 by 2 O2 gas 3 by 2 O2 gas gives the SO3 gas this chemical reaction we have to given right and we have to calculate the heat change at a constant pressure and a constant volume so we know that heat change at a constant pressure that is equals to delta H heat change at a constant pressure heat change at a constant pressure heat change at constant pressure heat change at a constant heat change at a constant pressure that is equals to delta h and heat change at a constant volume heat change at a constant volume heat change at a constant volume that is equals to delta u heat change at a constant volume that is equals to delta u so we have to find out the difference between this constant pressure and constant volume so we know that the relation between delta h and delta u in the chemical reaction so the relation between delta h and delta u in a chemical reaction that is a delta h that is equals to delta u plus delta ngrt this is the relation between delta h and delta u in a chemical reaction but we have to find out the heat action at a this is delta h is represent heat action at a heat exchange at a constant pressure and delta u represent heat change at a constant volume but we have to find out the difference between this so now we can write this term is delta h minus delta u that is equals to delta ngrt right now we have to calculate this delta ngrt that is equals to difference between this delta h minus delta u so we know that where delta ng delta ng is represent the change in gaseous moles of product minus change in gaseous moles of reactant so in this in the chemical reaction we have to see only the gaseous moles because the delta ng is the change in the gaseous moles of product minus change in the gaseous moles of reactant so in a chemical reaction we have to see only the gaseous moles so for the given reaction we have to the given reaction that is the given reaction 1 by 8 acid solid 1 by 8 s 8 solid plus 3 by 2 o2 gas plus 3 by 2 O2 gas gives the SO3 gas. This chemical reaction we have to given. Now we can calculate delta Ng for this given reaction. So now delta Ng that is equal to change in gaseous moles of products. So on the product side there is a one mole of SO3 gas is present. So one minus change in gaseous moles of reactant. So on the reactant side there is one by eight moles of acid is present. But acid is a solid. So we not include the solid. We have to see only the gaseous mole. So on reactant side only there is a 3 by 2 moles of O2 gas present. So now the calculate from this part we get a delta Ng that is equals to minus 1 by 2. Delta Ng that is equals to minus 1 by 2. So now we can easily calculate the difference between delta H and delta U. So now we can write delta H minus delta U that is equals to delta Ng that is a minus 1 by 2 into r where r is our universal gas constant into temperature t is in 300 kelvin so now the calculation from this part we get delta h minus delta u delta h minus delta u that is equals to minus 150 r so this is our heat change at a constant pressure and heat change at a constant volume 
डिफरेंस दैट इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन फिफ्टी इन टू आर सो द करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज द ऑप्शन नंबर टू माइनस वन फिफ्टी आर सो आई होप दिस आंसर डर क्वेश्चन थैंक यू फॉर क्लास सिक्स टू ट्वेल्थ आई टी जे एंड नीट लेवल ट्रस्टेड बाई मोर देन फाइव करोड़ स्टूडेंट्स डाउनलोड डाउट एंड आफ्टर डे